Hey guys and welcome to my channel. My name is Karen and welcome to Our Irish Family. Today I am going to be doing a cook with me and we are going to be cooking some Irish stew. Now there are a range of ways to make some stew but this is the way that I make it and that we enjoy here in my house. So without further ado, let's jump into today's cook with me. So the ingredients you're going to need. First out, we have an onion. We have three carrots. And at the back here, we have some potatoes. And these are the potatoes I have been using for the last while. You say potatoes by Wilson County, Wilson's Country. And they're the ready peeled fresh potatoes. I use these, I love them. They're great. Back here, we have some frozen peas. We also have some diced stewing beef. And then finally, I have a packet of oxtail soup. So let's get to it. So after I get my pan that I'm going to cook it in, I'm going to open the beef and place it inside the pan. I then I'm going to chop up chunkly my carrots and my onion. So next I'm going to add the oxtail soup and basically I am following the directions on the back of my soup packet. It told me to add 850 milliliters of water and then add the oxtail soup to it. So that's exactly what I did. At this stage I'm not going to add the potatoes or the peas. I'm going to leave these until 30 minutes towards the end. So basically what's in the pot right now I'm going to let that cook for 20 to 25 minutes and then I'm going to add the potatoes and the peas and cook for an additional 30 minutes um, or until tender. So this has been stewing away for around 20 minutes now and it's time to add the potatoes and the peas. Um, so as you can see here, I'm just putting in the potatoes and putting in the peas, giving it a good mix. I'm going to then bring it to a boil and then reduce to a simmer and cook for an additional 30 minutes. So now it has been cooking for 30 minutes. I am going to test to make sure that my potatoes and my carrots are tender. So I'm just sticking the knife in easily and it goes the whole way through, which is exactly the type of consistency I want. You can also break up your potatoes as well. So you can cut them just here at the side. That's it. I hope you enjoy. <laughs> 